What's up, YouTube? I'm back at y'all with another review today. Um, this one been talked about a lot. You probably know about it already, but if not, I'm gonna go over the basic details and the basic information that I pulled off fragrance. So let's get into this review. As you can tell by the title, today we're going over Boss Bottled Intense Eau de Parfum. All right. Now, Boss Bottled Intense came out in early 2015 as an intensified version of the original from 1998. And in September of 2016, they released Boss Bottled Intense Eau de Parfum. Now, I read on there that this the only difference between this and the other one is that this has 14% more fragrance oils. So, that's the only difference. So, let's get into the note breakdown of it and I'll give you all my take. This fragrance has fresh apple and it's balanced with notes of green orange blossom. The heart consists of cloves, cinnamon, and geranium. That's where you're going to get the, the uh, spice from this. The base... We have sandalwood, cedar, and vetiver with vanilla. Now this fragrance is often referred to as an apple pie smelling fragrance. And it definitely is, but you also get the, the orange blossom in there as well. Which to me, I mean it does smell like apple. You can definitely get that. You get the vanilla, you get the cinnamon. So yeah, I can see where people get apple pie when they smell this fragrance, but to me, I mean, you, you do get hints of it, but to me, it's not an apple pie smelling fragrance. There's other fragrances that smell more like apple pie, so, but this fragrance is amazing. Ooh, got a good sprayer, guys. Now this, straight off the bat. It's a nice sweet but also that that green orange blossom gives us a, a fresh smell as soon as it as soon as you spray it mm. but as it dries down it's definitely gonna get sweeter you're gonna get those the heart notes the cinnamon the cloves and then I love when the base kicks in the wood start coming in, the vanilla. This is an amazing fragrance. This fragrance right here lasts a really long time as well. For me, it's pushing 10 hours on my skin. Every wearing that I've worn this is pushing 10 hours. So, I mean, if you're looking for a long lasting apple pie fragrance, I'd suggest this one guys. I mean, this one's well loved in the community. A lot of people have reviewed it. For me, like I said, it's pushing 10 hours of projection on this. Within the first two hours, it's projecting pretty good. It projects about two and a half feet. After that, you know, it's gonna get closer, but it still projects for about one foot for at least five, six hours. I'm not saying it's pushing. You're going to have sea ice with this. But then after that, if people get close to you, you walk by somebody, they're still going to be smelling it for, like I said, around 10 hours. But yeah, this, this fragrance right here is beastly. I love it. It's hard not to like this fragrance. I mean, it's good. For me, I'd give this fragrance out of 10. It's going to be a solid eight and a half. So that's all I have to say about this, guys. If you liked it, give me a like. Make sure to hit that bell. Subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see y'all next time, man. I'm out. Subscribe if you haven't.